world is going on here? Disagreement from the locker room has spilled out here to the next. We've got Heidi Loveless, Joseph Biden, and Taylor Hendricks fighting over. This is a triple threat match from the Saturday Night Special for the Ladies' Championship. Girls, girl, I am, I'm so sick of both of you. I'm so sick of it. It's, it's overwhelming. Trash made this ma these matches tonight. You guys need to beat your opponents in under three minutes in order to get a one-on-one -on -one with me on the Saturday Night Special. So one of you girls better get your butt in that ring. Trailer Park Trash is setting up beat the clock matches. Three minutes each. Who can get the better of them? Well, right now we've got set for, uh, and it looks like it's going to be Poison Ivy, a.k.a. Taylor Hendricks, the first one. You know if you kiss her, it's all over for you. <laughs> well, right now we have a situation where we have two number one contenders. Of course, it was Taylor, who was the former women's champion, lost to Ivy a couple months ago to Saturday Night Special, hasn't had her rematch. But Joe said by them, beat Heidi in the last Saturday Night Special, so that made her number one contender, too. And your next contest is set for one fall. Introducing the opponents, first, Taylor Hendricks! And her opponent from Chicago, Illinois, this is December! Burn. Very interesting opponent here in December for Taylor Hendricks. I don't know if you remember this or if you were here yet, Titus, but December actually holds a victory over Taylor Hendricks from September 5th. No, I thought that was September that beat Taylor. No, it was December. Oh, well, I don't know anything about that. There's going to be this jaw jacket between Miss Josette Bynum and Taylor Hendricks. And costly seconds going lane. away. Cover here. That was a school girl. I mean, I don't even know what happens if December uh, is victorious in this match. Does she then become number one contender? No. Cover, cover. That, that won't work out because then Josette Bynum is just going to automatically become the number one contender full-fledged. The clock is going right now. Beat the clock challenge on the line. Whoever wins, the challenge is to win in under three minutes. And if you do, you have the opportunity for a one-on-one -on -one match instead of a triple threat at the Saturday night special as Taylor Hendricks shows her aggression. Taylor Hendricks right now has the greatest opportunity to set the time to beat. She can set it right now to the point where Josette Bynum could never beat it. And that's not favoring too well for Josette Bynum because she wants to be the number one contender. She wants that OVW Ladies Championship back. That'll make eight times that she'll be the OVW Women's Champion. As I understand it, you just have to beat that three-minute challenge here. Those are the rules set up by the director of operations, Trailer Park Trash. But looky here, Taylor Hendricks had December in a precarious position and then got distracted by Josette Bynum. This jaw jacket could cost Taylor. Oh, no. Almost caught her with a bone. <laughs> Literally and figuratively. There's the kick right to the head. Is this going to do it? Taylor Hendricks. Victorious. Here's your winner in one minute and 30 seconds. Wow. Taylor Hendricks. 90 seconds. That sets the bar pretty high. Not only did she do it in less than three minutes, she did it in half the time. I don't know. It's going to be a tough challenge for Miss Josette Bynum, but it's one that she's willing to accept because she wants that OVW Ladies Championship back around her waist. Josette, of course, seven times former OVW Women's Champion. At one point in time, the most dominant female competitor in OVW. Some say in OVW history. Again, continually jawjacking each other, trying to do these mind games and these psych out tactics. And your next contest is set for one call. Introducing first, she is the former seven-time OVW Ladies Champion, Josette Bynum. And introducing her opponent from Chicago, Illinois, 
This is Scarlett! As I was informed, uh, Philbert, that this uh, lady right here, Taylor Hendricks, she is the only redhead. She wants to be known as the only redhead in OVW. Scarlett may have something to say, but the clock is sounding and the, tekin, the seconds rather, are ticking away here. We'll excuse you for tonight. You're sick. You probably caught it from the old man who wasn't taking his vitamins and drinking his Ensure. Dean Hill is sick as a dog. Probably caused you some discomfort and making you lose out on a day's pay. And then me over here, picture perfect of health. And the key here, Titus, to this beat the clock challenge is not beating each other's time. Rather, they have to beat their opponent in less than three minutes. So Taylor Hendricks has done it. She has cashed her ticket in the Saturday night special. We know that she will face Heidi Loveless. Will Lady JoJo be there by her be there as well? But it's a sign of pride if you can beat your opponent in less time than, than your... Roll up here from Scarlett! ...than your competition. Wow, two That's and nine tenths. About. Lady JoJo better focus here. Look at this bridge right here. Could go for it. Hard to stay focused here. And you got to wonder if Taylor Hendricks... Cover here, cover. Is a distraction on the outside of the ring on purpose. Taylor doesn't want... She doesn't Joseph want Joseph Bynum? to be in the match. No, not exactly. at all. And Scarlett over there, she's capitalizing on all the distractions. Meanwhile, time is ticking away here. Oh, she just chipped a cap over there. Need to have her teeth bonded again. Josette Bynum coming away from the administrative offices of OVW and the executive assistant to the director of operation and stepping back in the ring after being outside the square circle for almost a year, Titus. She's come back, and she's come back with a vengeance, and she's stronger than ever. I mean, people thought that she'd have the ring rust, that she'd be incapable of doing it. Oh, look at here, look at here. Taylor Hendricks grabbing the foot of Joe Bynum champion. and Heidi Loveless. The bunny rabbit is attacking. Taking issue with this on the outside of the ring. Again, more distractions, but time, time is ticking away off the clock. Josette turns it around into the cover. That's going to do it. Did she beat it? Stick the foot. And here's your winner in two minutes in 12 seconds. Two 12. Josette Bynum. They've both done it in under three minutes, That's Titus. Live, Mike. Over there, talk to Terry Bodie, Taylor. And you know what that means. we still got a triple threat situation on our hands for the special. The title is still on the line. Will Heidi Loveless lose her title? Yeah, as a matter of fact, I do have something to say to you. Time's a ticking, Josette. I am still the number one contender, and as far as I'm concerned, we'll both be at Saturday Night Special, and I will have that title around my way. You will have nothing. Oh, I, I will be the oh, new OVW Women's Champion after the Saturday Night Special for the eighth it. time, and there is nothing, there is nothing that you can do about it, and there is nothing you can do about it. That is a married couple. I've beaten you, <laughs> and if you recall, I've beaten you. And you girls, just remember that this title isn't going anywhere on Saturday. The stakes have never been higher for the OVW Ladies Championship. <laughs> well, Lady JoJo, Joseph Bynum doesn't want to wait for the Saturday Night Special. It's a fight. This one's breaking a loose right now. You said the stakes have never been higher. Triple threat match, title on the line. Which diva is going to reign supreme in OVW? We need help out here. Huh? 